at the 1400. There they go, they're racing away. They got away to a neat start as well. But where the bomb is the first one to show. Golden Angel rides up there, hustles up to go forward. Then comes Scarlet McCaw, Pilot Flame. Well, Gug is at the outside. Tokyo Princess, widest of all. Spoil yourself. White sleeves, black cap. A little bit deep, but racing handy enough. Further back to my sensation. Just behind midfield, Awe Kazi. Then came Little Miss Pink, who's one off the rail. Polynomial switched off. She does have a good turn of foot, but she's doing it about 11 lanes off the leader and a few lanes away to Eureka Diamond, who's just all over the place, wayward and not really going all that well down the side of the track. They got just under 800 meters left to run. New leader, where Gug went round, took the lead. Golden Angel right there in second. Tokyo Princess, but where the bomb is against the rail. Then comes Scarlet McCaw, just over length away. Spoil yourself. Then came my sensation, the Aquamarine racing around midfield with Pilot Flame for company. Awe Kazi. Then came Little Miss Pink at their outside as Polynomial. And the back marker is Eureka Diamond. They homeward bound, little under 500 meters left to run. With Gug Red Cap and Golden Angel Red Cap with Beware the Bomb far inside. Scarlet McCall's emerging as a runner. Then comes My Sensation. Spoil yourself up towards the inside as Little Miss Pink as they now approach the last 200 meters. And Scarlet McCall's come into the lead with Beware the Bomb. They look set to fight this out with My Sensation turning it on late as well. But Beware the Bomb has it won. Beware the Bomb beat My Sensation. Third went the way of Scarlet McCall and then came Little Miss Pink. But where the bomb wins race number seven. Daughter of Lancaster bomber Justin Snaith, Grand Fanica, owned and bred by the Drakenstein stunt nominee Gaynor Rupert. She's got the bragging rights here, has number one, Beware the Bomb. Fluent victory by three parts of a length. Number two, My Sensation, I think is a very nice racehorse. I don't think Hollywood Beds Durbanville suits her, but she's still run with a plum in defeat. Likewise, number six, Scarlet McCaw, she's holding her form. And she's proving to be of reasonable quality as well. Then came number four, Little Miss Pink, Polynomial, Spoil Yourself. There are a lot of horses in here that I think are worth a few more chances. Pilot Flame, Awe Kazi, and Golden Angel included. Then came Wagug and Tokyo Princess with Eureka Diamond, never all that happy. So Beware the Bomb is towards the extreme right-hand side. Drifts right across the field as Beware the Bomb. With My Sensation, three off the left-hand side and the Aquamarine staying on nicely. Scarlett McCaw had a peep. She ran nicely. And as did uh, Little Miss Pink towards the right-hand side. Look at that. Three-year-olds, one, two, and three here. Number one, Beware the Bomb, like I said, gets the bragging rights today. But there are a lot in here that uh, look like they're of reasonable quality.